So we are actually live now, um, and I'm watching myself live. This is great. <laughs> We've got a few people who've already joined us, which is fantastic. Um, and we'll have Yahtzee. Welcome, Dom. Welcome, Carol, Lindsay and Charlotte. You're all there. This is really confusing because I've got I Nicole, Nat. Um, I've got a smaller screen of me as well, which is great. Hi, Charlotte. Um, yeah, welcome to the indoor studio. Uh, not quite as glamorous as uh, Jimmy's studio, but um, nevertheless, uh, it beats uh, being out in the dark and not being able to see, although I much prefer that. Um, so welcome everybody. And uh, as you may have noticed, Kelly is not with me this evening. She's actually in the other room. Uh, ready to do her little bit uh, of the session. Hi Becky, uh, hi Colin, and everybody else who's joining us. Hi Helen. Um, so yes, so <laughs> you like what we've done with the place. Yeah, it, it, it does look a little bit like we've been robbed. Um, Tiger is actually uh, confined, Jen, uh, into the four corners of the uh, kitchen. <laughs> hi Lou. Um, yeah, so Tiger's not allowed to out at all. Um, and I don't want anybody uh, coaxing him out either uh, so we can get through the session. Hi Vicky, hi Lou. Um, so yes, it's, uh, it, it's getting ready um, and it's going to be a good session this evening. Um, it, it's quite hot, I tried it earlier on um, and it, if you've got ventilation, please use it. Um, it's going to be a busy day uh, and it's going to be oh no really well oh yes really yeah so no bum tonight no Jen um, it's going to be a, a sweat session this evening um, so if you've got windows open them um, because it's going to be uh, it's going to be a tough one uh, so what we've got for you this evening um, we are doing a hit session uh, so we're working two rounds uh, 40 seconds off on with a 20 seconds off um, beard, yeah, I've, I've got a beard. Hi, cuz, how you doing? Um, yes, so we've got three sections um, and we're doing each section uh, twice and then uh, total uh, all over body, um, focusing on your legs, your abs and your arms as well. So as we go through, uh, we will obviously uh, take a break after each set uh, with a one minute break and then go straight into section two. Uh, those exercises with 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, and then uh, a minute rest, and then to section three. So if you are all ready, and we are uh, getting raring to go, if we stand up and uh, make sure that you've got some space uh, around you, and if it is your first time, make sure that you filled in uh, your health questionnaire and you are ready to rock and roll. You are safe to exercise, um, but make sure you've got some water, and make sure that uh, you take regular breaks if you need it, if this is your first time. Um, make sure that the area is clear around you and then you're not gonna hurt yourselves if you need to get up and down. Hi Ben, welcome. Hi little Kate, happy birthday. Um, and uh, yes, well done for smashing out all those burpees earlier on today. Uh, unfortunately, uh, there are no burpees in this session, um, or oh, there is a variation. Um, so you'll just have to wait and uh, anybody else who's got a birthday in between now and the time we go back outdoors we can add them to Kate's tally so you can all do them in the park when I can see you. Cool so let's get going then we are ready to rock and roll and if you find your space wherever you are and just from there nice and easy just start rotating those arms around forward nice straight arms good Keeping the arms nice and straight, so rotating out. And then from there, just rotate them to the rear. Good. And from there, front to back, just open up the palms facing the ceiling, or up to the sky if you're outdoors. Just cross the body. Good. And then from there, just rotate. From left to right, keeping your heels firmly planted to the ground, feet pointing in front of you. So all you're doing is twisting your trunk and the top of your body. 
Good. Make that motion a little bit bigger by taking the opposite hand, uh, opposite foot off the ground. So heel off the ground and twist. Using your arms to rotate left to right. Good. I'm hoping everybody can see me. Excellent. And from there, if you just have your hands, says Kelly, just in front of you, if you have your hands right in front of you, just keep that hand pointing out in front and just rotate out to the rear, opposite left to right. So we open left to right. Good. So you're opening out your pecs, your shoulders, and your lats as well. Good. Good, keep looking forward, change from left to right, good and from there just hands on your hips, just rotate those hips round to the left, and then change over round to the right, Kelly can see, <laughs> she's coming in, she's moving my mat. <laughs> Good, all the technical problems. Good, and then change over to the left. And then round to the right, one more time. Excellent stuff. From there then guys, what we're gonna go is knee straight up and straight behind you and just lean back so you're stretching out your hamstring and your quad. So knee up and then stretch back. Knee up and stretch back. So we're going right side first, knee up, stretch the left leg back. Right leg up, left leg back. Good. So we're going to do 10 in total. And then we're going to change and do the opposite side. Good. Really stretch out the hamstring on the left. Just knee straight up. So we're just warming up the glutes and the hips because you're going to be working them really hard this evening. Good. And from there, we'll change over. So left leg up, right leg back. Left leg up, right leg back. Good. Really stretch it back. Point the toes up to the ceiling if you can. Good, and the last one from there. Change legs. This time, one hand out in front, just so leg swings. Just get them straight up, straight back down. Opposite hand to foot. Good, just 10 on one side and 10 on the other side. Off we go. So, as I say, we've got three sections to these sets this evening. First section is all about your cardio, legs as well as arms. And then we move into an out section, which is using your trunk and your arms. And then the last section, which will be using just your abs. We will go for 40 seconds and then we'll go minute break at the end. So, are we all feeling nice and warm? Give us a thumbs up if you're ready. <laughs> Guest appearance by Kelly Bailey, that's right. She's now in the other room and she's ready to rock and roll. So give us a thumbs up and let us know that you're all okay, you're all ready to rock and roll, and then we'll uh, get going straight into the first set. So first exercise we've got is a frog squat, going straight into three squats, okay? So we use the timer for 40 seconds with a 20 second break. So frog squats first, and then we'll go uh, three squats. So from here, you're in your press up position. Okay, nice quick demo. From there, both legs come straight up to your hands, straight up, Squat, one, two, three. Straight back down into that press up position. Frog squat in, one, two, three squats afterwards. Okay, all understand? We're ready to rock and roll. So into position then guys, we've got 40 seconds of the exercise. So round one, here we go. Off we go. So into position, one, and one, two, Three squats, straight back down, back in. One, two, three, straight back down. Legs both out, nice and straight behind you. Back's nice and straight. 
back straight, chest up in your squat position. Make sure those knees are just behind you. Straight back down, bring it back in. Good. And down, back in. Last five seconds then. Kick them out, bring them in. And rest it there. Good. Excellent stuff then guys. That's right. first exercise done. Second set, you've got five jumping jacks, 10 high knees. So into position then, in five, four, three, two, one. Five jumping jacks. 10 high knees. Five jumping jacks. 10 high knees. Good, let's keep going. Really pump the arms. Good, let's keep it going guys. Tigers trying to break in. <laughs> Good, and rest it there. Well done. Good, holding it there you guys. You've got 15 seconds. Next exercise is a wide arm press up. You can go down onto your knees if you need to. After you've done your wide grip press up, you've got 10 mountain climbers. So let's get it ready into position. In three, two, one, off we go. Good, make sure, nice straight backs, nice knees up to the elbows, keeping the bums down, 10 in total. And breathe through the motions then guys, keep it going, last five seconds. Good, and rest it there. Excellent stuff, last exercise then. You've got reverse lunges. I want you to do three on one side, then a curtsy lunge. Then three on the other side, and a curtsy lunge. So you're gonna go from here, back down, straight up, and then a curtsy lunge at the end. Off we go. So down, right leg only, that's two, that's three, and then from there, cross, curtsy lunge. Opposite leg, one, two, three, and then curtsy lunge. So cross the body, straight back in, back up. One, two, three, straight up, curtsy lunge. Then opposite, one, two, three, and then a curtsy lunge, across the body. Then change, as many as we can do then guys. And cross, and rest it there. That's set one, done, nothing else. Good, we've got one minute break, and then we get going. Good, grab some water, how are we feeling after that first set? Everybody all right? Got some new people signing in today, which is great. Welcome everyone. Good, if you're happy, uh, I'm starting to get a little bead of sweat on, which is great. Um, <laughs> Most of you don't think I sweat at the park, but uh, I definitely do. Um, we've got 30 seconds left to go then, guys, and we'll go straight into section two, which the first exercise is a plank walkout uh, with shoulder taps. So you're gonna do four shoulder taps, shattered already? Come on, Debs. <laughs> um, so we're gonna do straight down plank walkout, four shoulder taps, left, right, left, right, and then straight back, walking back out. You've got 15 seconds. And we go straight into it. So from there, walk all the way out, four shoulder taps, keeping yourselves nice and controlled. Walk all the way back out, tap your toes. Back forward, one, two, three, four, walk all the way back. So into position then guys, and we're ready to rock and roll. Off we go. Let's make it work then team. Straight out, walk it all the way out, keep it controlled. Walk in all the way back, touch the toes, walk forward. One, two, three, four. 
It's not about speed, it's about control. Walking all the way forward. Make sure you've got that nice press up position. One, two, three, four. Don't rock your bodies. Walking all the way back, touch your toes. Walk it forward. One, two, three, four. Walk it back. And then walk it forward. One, two, three, four. Walk it backwards. Touch the toes. Walk it forward. And rest it there. Good. Section two, exercise one. We're going to the next one. Here's a low plank, hip dip. So into your low plank, elbows on the ground. In three, two, one. And we're going to move from left to right. Hips just touching the ground. Just touch the ground. Left to right. Keeping the back nice and tense. Just look forward. Keep it working. Twist the hips. You're working the core. Left to right. Good, let's make it work then team. You've got another 10 seconds. Let's push it through. Five seconds. Left to right. And rest it there. Good work. Good efforts guys, good work. Next one from there. You will know how to do a sit up or a half sit. So when your heels firmly planted on the ground, hands either side of your temple or across your chest. Let's make sure those elbows touching the ground and elbows touching the knees on the way back up. Into position then, off we go. Nice and controlled. It's not about the speed, it's about control. Keep it working all the way through. If your hands are not on your temple, make sure they're across your chest, elbows touching your knees. All the way up, all the way back down. If you can't, hands on your thighs, straight up, half sit. Heels of your hands touching your knees, and then straight back down. Last 10 seconds then, guys. Let's keep it going, keep it working. Five seconds to go. And rest it there. Good work, team. Good effort. Good. Next one from here is a single twist sit up. So, 10 seconds to explain it. We're going to go from here, is all the way down. One elbow is planted on the ground with your hand, the other one, reach over, touch the elbow, touch the knee. Off we go. So, if you're going to do the left side on the outside of your right knee, make sure your right elbow and your hand straight down on the ground. Twist, put the elbow down. Twist, put the elbow down. Nice and control. Really reach from here. Touch the outside of the opposite knee. Good, let's keep it working all the way through. And then, you guessed it, after your 20 second break, you've got the opposite side to do. Good. If you can all hear it, I am blown. And rest it there then guys. So 20 seconds, you've got the opposite side to do. So you've got your left sides if you've done them, you've got your right sides now and vice versa. You've got 10 seconds to go. Grab a breath in five, four, three, two, one. Off we go, opposite sides. Elbow down to the ground, outside of your hand, touching the opposite knee or over, twist, keeping the opposite elbow and hand touching the ground, shoulder touching the ground. Really reach, twist, straight back down. Good, let's keep it going all the way through. And this is the last exercise in section two. Good work team. We keep it working for the last five seconds. Press all the way through. Breathe through the exercise and rest it there. Well done. Good. That's section two done. You've got one minute break. Grab some water if you need it. How are we feeling? Good, you've got that last 50 seconds. Tell me how you're feeling if everybody's still there. We've got a few new people signing in, which is great. Thank you for joining us and uh, get involved if you need to. Good, and then our last section is section three. 
we've got prisoner sit-ups, then we've got leg raises, we have star crunches, and we've got alternate V-sits. Okay, so four ab exercises, and then we go straight back and cycle through. <laughs> Absolutely shattered already. Oh, Harry, come on. Good, last 15 seconds then, guys. We're going straight through. It is a cheeky ab workout, Cole. I did tell you it was gonna be hard, it was gonna be sweaty. Good, last five seconds. So straight, first exercise is a prisoner squat, which will go in three, two, uh, prisoner sit-up, sorry. And off we go. So hands behind your heads, heels all the way together, and knees out. Hands all the way up, touch your toes all the way back down. Hands up, touch your toes all the way back down. Now that we cycled through nearly three sets, we're gonna go through and do section one, two, and three once again. Last 13 seconds of this exercise. Good. Let's keep it going. Try and keep your heels firmly planted to the ground. Feet together as much as they go. Knees out. Good, and rest it there. Excellent stuff. Next one is a leg raise. So from there, all you're gonna be doing is keeping your legs back straight to the ground, legs all the way up to the sky, and lower them down if you need to. Just place your hands on your bum, or just at the base of your spine. Here we go, off we go. Legs all the way up, heels just hovering off the ground. Relax your head, keep breathing, and just lower the heels to the ground. Don't put the heels on the ground. Straight back up as soon as you come down low. Good, let's raise them all the way up. Hand blow, lower them down, nice and gentle. Straight up, straight down. Good efforts team, 15 seconds. It's my favorite phrase, which gives you a little bit of perspective of the time left. And last five seconds, good. Let's keep it going then team. And last second, and rest. Good stuff, 20 second break then, and we go straight into your star crunches. So from here, I want you to hands out behind you, and all the way in, you're gonna crunch up, squeeze all the way in, and then explode all the way out. Bring them in, explode all the way out, off we go. Let's make them work then guys. Legs all the way out, like a star motion, and then crunch them all the way back in. Kick them out, bring them back in. All the way out, and bring them back in. Good, if you need to hold on to the knees just to keep that momentum and the control, keep working it. Breathe all the way through, the last 10 seconds. Keep it controlled, excellent work. It's all about the control, three, Two, one, and rest. Good, last exercise there then team, is your alternate V-sit. So if you can and you're confident, do a double V-sit. If you're not, one leg out, one arm up. So straight up, touch, straight back down, opposite side, okay? In three, two, one, off we go. Last exercise then guys, alternate from left to right. If you've got a dodgy back, like me, let's make sure we're keeping it controlled, as many as you can do. If your legs don't go straight, just go and touch your knees. Straight back down, arms out in front, and touch, and back down, straight up. For those who are whippets and can go straight and touch their toes, nice straight legs because they're very flexible, do so. Good, last five seconds then. In three, two, one, and rest. You got a minute break then guys, and we go straight into round one again. Good stuff, how are we feeling? <laughs> Feel the motion, <laughs> Feel the motion Jimmy, that's right. That's it, three sections with those different varying exercises. As Jimmy says, feel the motion. Once you've broken through that pain barrier, it is all just about the motion. So get into the groove and make it work for yourselves. Good, last 30 seconds then, and we're getting ready to go again. So grab some water, towel yourselves off, 
And we're going to go back into section one again, which we're going to put that heart rate straight back up through the roof. So you've got your frog squats straight into uh, three squats and then five jumping jacks into 10 high knees. And then you've got your five wide grip press ups straight down into your 10 mountain climbers. And then your three reverse lunge on one side, three reverse lunges on the other side with your curtsy lunges in between. So last five seconds then. Bit of water into position for your frog squats and off we go. So straight down into position, bring it in. One, two, three, straight back out. Bring it in. One, two, three, and straight back out. Bring it in. One, two, three, good. Let's get working then team. Nice and controlled all the way through the motions, keeping your chest up nice and tall. Legs out, nice and straight. Good. All the way out, all the way in. Chest up, nice and tall. Make sure those knees are behind the feet. Behind your toes. And rest it there. That's your 20 seconds done of that exercise. So 40 seconds done. You've got five jumping jacks in 15 seconds. Five jumping jacks, 10 high knees. Let's make it work then, team. In five seconds. Four. Three, two, one, and ready, off we go. Good, let's make it work. <laughs> and there's a showing from the dog. <laughs> Good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Good, let's make it work. Good, let's pump the arms in, guys. Pump the legs. And rest it there. Good. Okay, last 15 seconds. We go straight into five wide arm press ups and then down for your 10 mountain climbers. Good. <laughs> Perfect night on the patio. I know, Lou, tell me about it. I wish I was out there. Unfortunately, I'd slip on mine. Ready, off we go. Five wide press ups. And 10 mountain climbers. Good, let's make it work then, guys. Nice and strong. Good, and then from there, rest from there. Good stuff. My mat's dropping. Last exercise then, team. Here's your reverse lunges with your curtsy lunge. Good. So you're gonna step it back, all the way back. Down and up, back down and up. Ready, off we go. One, two, three, and then curtsy, and then change. One, two, three, and then up and curtsy. Good, let's make sure those legs, your chest, it's nice and straight all the way up. Don't wobble left to right, and then up, to the opposite side. Make sure your standing foot is firmly planted. Two, three, straight up and curtsy. Last 10 seconds. One, two, three, and then curtsy. Good, and rest it there. One minute break then guys. Good stuff. We'll pause that. Good work. How's the second time round feeling? <laughs> God, we've got loads of people. <laughs> loads and loads of people. And it was only a matter of time before Tiger broke through the barrier. I don't understand why or how, but he's a clever dog. If he can open a fridge, he can obviously break through a couple of chairs. Um, cool. So section two, again, plank walkouts. We've got four shoulder taps, nice and controlled. You're starting to fatigue now. The shoulders are starting to ache. The arms are starting to ache. So nice and controlled when you're moving left to right. Move round to the outside. Well done, Becky. 
If you've got the space, do it. It is really hot in here. Nobody wants to be in my dining room right now. Good, last 15 seconds. And we go straight, plank, walk out, four shoulder taps, okay? Excellent, last five seconds. Four, three, two, one. And here we go, off we go then team. Let's make it count. Good, all the way out, four shoulder taps, nice and controlled. And walk back, touch your toes. Walk forward, one, two, three, four. All the way back, touch the toes. Nice straight backs. All the way back, touch the toe. Good, don't dip the hips. Keep the hips nice and tall, nice and straight. We in line with the back. And rest it there. Good stuff then guys. Last 20 seconds, and we're going straight into your hip dips, left to right. Good. <laughs> Hi Sam, nice to see you. <laughs> Good. How's Damien, is he okay? Hopefully you're both watching from France, and you're joining in on the live workouts as well. Good, ready, off we go. So hip dips in low plank, let's do it. Left to right, left to right. Keep looking nice and straight. Twist the hips. Twist. Touch the opposite hip to the ground. Good. Excellent stuff, guys. Last 20 seconds. Last 10 seconds. You're all doing well. Don't dip the form. Keeping the backs nice and straight. All the way through in three, two, one, and rest. Last 20 second break, and you've got your twist sit ups from left to right. Remember, keeping that elbow firmly planted to the ground as you turn over, firmly planted to the ground, hand on the ground, opposite hand touching the opposite knee. And if you're really confident, I want you to touch the elbow to the opposite knee. Good, let's make it work then. Left to right. Twist, keeping that other hand that's not doing much. Firmly planted to the ground. Elbow in line with shoulder. So you're keeping that shoulder firmly planted as well. Good, let's make it count then team. This is to the left or the right side. And then we're gonna do the opposite in a second. Three, two, one, and rest it there. Good, last 20 seconds, you've got the last exercise in section two. I hope we're all feeling okay. You've got a 10 second break. Getting into a position now, last five seconds, in three, two, one, and off we go. Let's move, twist, from left, to right. You should feel it through the obliques and through the center of the abs, or the outer wall of your abs. Twist from left to right, or right to left. Good. Keeping the elbow firmly planted to the ground with the opposite hand, and twist all the way around. Good, last 10 seconds. Then you've got a minute break coming up. Breathe out and rest it there. Good, last minute break then guys. Excellent stuff, cool. Excellent work. We've got the third and final round, which is your prisoner sit-ups, your leg raises, and then you've got your star crunches and your alternate V-sits. Hi Russ, how you doing? I'm hoping that you're training tonight in your new Atlas Fitness t-shirt. If not, your uh, rat race one would do. <laughs> um, good. So we've got your last 30 seconds. And if anybody wants to know what prisoner sit up, again, it is from here. Both heels firmly planted together, touching the soles of your feet, hands out, knees out, all the way out. 
and bring it back in, touching the toes, all the way back out, bring them back in, touching the toes. Cool. Last 10 seconds then. And we get into position, we're gonna move forward. Good. Ready? Off we go. All the way out and touching the toes, all the way back down, all the way back up, touch the toes. Keeping the heels to the ground as much as possible, all the way up, arms up, over your head, back down, touching the ground. Good efforts everywhere, let's keep it going. You've got the last 10 seconds of this exercise. Last five seconds. Let's make it work guys, you're doing well. No one likes abs, but we want them for the summer time. Last 20 seconds, excellent. Leg raises is your next exercise. As I say, all those summer bodies are made in winter, aren't they? So we'll do all the foundation work now and you come out the other side of Christmas, really, really strong. Ready, into position, leg raises. Off we go, all the way up and lower all the way down. Just breathe through the motion. Straight up, straight down. Good, let's keep it going then team. You're doing well. Last 20 seconds. Last 10 seconds. Let's make it count guys. I know those legs are feeling quite heavy. Well mine are certainly. <laughs> In three, two, one, and rest it there. Good. Straight from there, the last 20 second break you've got, you're going straight into your star crunches, and then we go into the penultimate last exercise, or well, star crunches, your penultimate, and your alternate V-sits as your last. In three, two, one, star crunches, off we go. All the way out, crunch them in. All the way out, bring them in. Good. Let's work then, guys. Two exercises left. This one and your alternate V-sits. Nice and controlled. Good. 20 seconds to go. Use your whole core to bring yourself up and release them all the way down. Last 10 seconds then. Control all the way out. Bring them all the way back in. Last three, two, one, and rest. Final exercise then guys, you've all smashed it so far, and you've got that alternate V-sit to finish. Once you're done, it's game over. Right arm across the body type. Good, good. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, off we go. Final exercise then guys, just push it in. Let's keep it going. Good, breathe through those exercises then team. Last 20 seconds. Let's get those legs up nice and straight. Last 15, let's keep them going. Good, 10 seconds, five seconds. Excellent work guys. <laughs> Good, in three, two, one, and rest it there. Excellent stuff. How are we all feeling? I'm hot, I know everybody else must be, unless you're training in a, uh, in a nice air conditioned environment. Good, give us a thumbs up and let you know how you feel. That's a great session guys, excellent stuff. Cool, so we'll go straight into a cool down. We'll take that right hand across the body and uh, we'll stretch it all the way out. So take that right hand across the body, nice and easy, and left hand just above the elbow, stretch all the way across. Point your thumbs up, turn them all the way upside down, and just look over the opposite side that's been stretched. Good. Just keep it there, team, keep it there. <laughs> your mono ab is on fire. I should be still laughing at Jenny's comment. Good. Cool. And release from there, change the opposite side, 
tilt the thumb all the way upside down, turn to the left hand side or the right hand side, whichever way you're stretching and look over that shoulder. Good, and release from there. So put one hand in between the shoulder blades, the other one on top of the elbow, and you should be able to stretch all the way down the shoulder blade, keeping the close elbow to your ear, and stretch the tricep. Good. Particularly warm session this evening, so credit to Jimmy in his sweat box. He did Saturday's session and obviously throughout the, uh, the summer and obviously I don't have any plants in this side of the house. Good, and change because it gets so hot, unless it's a cactus, it won't survive in here. Good. Good, try to take that chin off the chest, keep looking forward. Good, and release it from there. You just take the lacy part of your trainers, if you're already standing up, and just stretch off those quads. So bring that knee into the other knee, keeping your hips pointing forward, and try and get that heel touching the bum, keeping your body shape nice and tall. Good, keeping yourself in line. Good, and release from there, change sides. Good, heel firmly planted into your backside, knees in line with each other. If you need your arm out, hand on your ear, just keeping your chest up nice and tall, hips forward. Good, and release it from there. If you take your legs out just a little bit wider than shoulder width apart, and just stretch your adductor by bending one knee, pointing both feet forward. From there, just keeping your chest up. I don't want to see you doing this with your chest down. Keep it up as far as it can go, and just stretch all the way across so you can feel it working on the adductor. And we do another exercise in a second. Good, and change the opposite side, so really stretch that adductor, to push all your body weight into that bent knee, keeping that leg nice and straight, keeping your chest up tall as it would go. Good, and rest it there. If you go down into a lunge position for me, put one knee to the ground, and then just straighten, lean back onto that bent knee, and straighten out that hamstring. So leg nice and straight, and just lean all the way forward, point the toes forward, stretch all the way down, so you feel it working on the hamstring. If you can touch your toes, great. If not, both hands on the ankle, or the tops of your socks, or just stretch as far forward as you can without twisting your back left to right, as straight as possible. Good, and from there, just pick yourself up, just lock your leg back onto the bent knee, and just push your hips forward, so you're stretching that hip flexor on the opposite side. Good, and rest it from there. 
change sides into a lunge position down on the bent knee keeping the front leg nice and straight so if you can go down low do so put both hands if you can onto the tops of your toes if not onto your ankles on the tops of your socks you can go all the way down and sit down your bum onto your foot and you're really really flexible unlike myself just stretch forward And rest it from there, just put the foot forward, stretch out that hip flexor, keeping the chest up nice and tall, stretch out. Good, and rest it there. Well done everybody, awesome session, I enjoyed it. I hope everybody else did as well. So thank you for tuning in. And uh, for those who are wanting to do the... <laughs> Hi, Kelly. Uh, for those of you who want to join in to the uh, virtual run session tomorrow evening, here we go, here's Tiger as well. Everybody say hello to Tiger. We were all making all that noise earlier on. Um, thank you, everyone. Um, yes, so those of you who want to join in to the uh, run session tomorrow, uh, the details will be posted out onto um, our social media pages so you can get a note of what it is that you're expected to do. And uh, we hope that uh, we see plenty of results. And uh, thank you, everybody, for your uh, efforts this evening. And we look forward to seeing you on Thursday. Ah! <laughs> Good night, everybody. Bye. <laughs> thank Bye. you very much. Have fun. <laughs> oh.